Are you planning to travel in the upcoming year of 2024? Wondering where you can roam freely, soak in the sights, and feel secure all the while? We got you covered as we unveil the safest cities to add to your 2024 travel list, where you can explore with peace of mind and create memories without worry. Without further ado, let's begin. Coming in at number 1, Tokyo, Japan. In Tokyo, the meticulous attention to detail extends to the safety of its residents and visitors. It's a city where traditional values coalesce with cutting-edge technology to create a uniquely secure environment. This is complemented by a societal commitment to collective responsibility. Each individual tends to act with the well-being of others in mind, which is evident in the low incidence of petty crimes like littering or vandalism. Moreover, the city's transport system is a marvel of safety and efficiency, often cited as a benchmark for other cities globally. Beyond its efficient urban layout and strong community policing, the city's use of earthquake-resistant construction methods reflects its dedication to safety in the face of natural disasters. There's also a cultural inclination towards order and harmony, which permeates through every aspect of life. From the meticulous organization of public events to the disciplined behavior in public spaces, reducing the likelihood of disturbances and violence. At number 2. Singapore Singapore's approach to safety extends into its urban planning, with well-maintained public areas that discourage criminal behavior through their design. The city's investment in education promotes social responsibility from an early age, cultivating a population that values order and discipline. This societal mindset, combined with a zero-tolerance policy towards corruption, ensures that the rule of law is upheld and the streets remain safe. The city-state of Singapore is a textbook example of proactive governance aimed at preserving public order and safety. The cleanliness of Singapore is legendary, and it's achieved through a combination of civic education and stringent laws against littering and vandalism. This cleanliness contributes to the city's orderliness and sense of well-being. At number 3. Osaka, Japan. Osaka's residents benefit from a comprehensive support system that extends from healthcare to housing, contributing to social stability. This stability is a deterrent against crimes of desperation. The city also fosters a strong sense of local identity and pride, which manifests in well-cared-for public spaces and a collective effort to maintain order and safety. Osaka shares many of Tokyo's safety features but has its own unique community spirit, known as Kwaidor, which translates to eating oneself into ruin. This expression of love for food and life reflects a broader cultural appreciation for the joys of living, which contributes to the city's low stress levels and thus to its safety. At number 4. Amsterdam, Netherlands The city's safety is further enhanced by a well-developed public health system that includes accessible mental health resources, playing a crucial role in preventing crime. The Dutch capital is famous for its liberal attitudes, which extend to its approach to law enforcement. Rather than punitive measures, Amsterdam focuses on harm reduction strategies. For instance, its approach to drug use emphasizes education and control, aiming to reduce the associated risks rather than criminalizing users. This pragmatic approach has resulted in lower drug-related crime rates. Furthermore, the city's extensive canal system is not just a tourist attraction, but also contributes to an open and transparent urban environment, where community surveillance is natural. At number 5, Sydney, Australia. The layout of Sydney, with its open vistas and clear sight lines, allows for natural surveillance. This urban design concept, known as crime prevention through environmental design, CPTED, is evident in Sydney's planning. It encourages the creation of spaces that are intuitively safe, minimizing hidden spots and dark alleys where crime could easily go unnoticed. The city's commitment to keeping these areas well-lit and well-maintained further amplifies this effect. On a social level, Sydney's policies reflect a deep understanding of the correlation between social exclusion and crime. The city's myriad initiatives aimed at fostering inclusivity serve to knit a tighter social fabric. There is a strong emphasis on providing support for marginalized groups, especially on housing. At number 6, Toronto, Canada. Toronto's mosaic of cultures is not just a testament to Canada's immigration success story. It is a cornerstone of the city's overall safety and stability. The metropolis serves as a shining example of how cultural diversity can contribute to the strength and security of an urban environment. This interweaving of cultures has fostered an atmosphere where differences are not just tolerated but celebrated. 
Toronto's approach to integration is proactive and intentional. The city's infrastructure is designed to include community centers, libraries, and support services that are accessible to people from all walks of life. These services play a crucial role in providing a safety net for new immigrants, helping them to navigate their new environment, learn the language, find employment, and integrate into the community. At number seven, Copenhagen, Denmark. Copenhagen's reputation as one of the world's most livable cities is intrinsically linked to its approach to urban design, which places a high priority on safety and community. The city's layout promotes a sense of accessibility and visibility, with wide open streets that are more than just thoroughfares for cars but are seen as communal living spaces. These areas encourage residents and visitors alike to walk, linger, and engage with their surroundings, fostering a bustling street life that enhances public safety through natural surveillance. The Danish concept of KIG, often translated as coziness or comfort, is also reflected in Copenhagen's urban environment. It encapsulates a philosophy that goes beyond aesthetics to encompass the feeling of community, safety, and well-being. At number 8, Stockholm, Sweden. Stockholm, the capital of Sweden, stands as a paragon of urban safety, underpinned by a social welfare system that is deeply woven into the societal fabric. The city's physical design is another key element in its safety strategy. Stockholm's urban spaces are meticulously planned and maintained, with an emphasis on cleanliness, order, and natural beauty. Stockholm's unique geography, interspersed with its iconic archipelago, contributes to the city's low crime rates. The waterways and bridges connecting the city's islands create natural boundaries that help regulate access and egress, allowing for better monitoring and control of urban areas. This geographical arrangement also contributes to the city's aesthetic appeal and recreational value, with many residents and tourists spending their time near or on the water, further increasing public presence and vigilance. At number 9, Hong Kong. Hong Kong, widely recognized as a bustling metropolis, has long been lauded for its efficient and modern infrastructure, which plays a pivotal role in the city's safety. The city's high-density living is complemented by an infrastructure that is meticulously designed to serve its large population effectively. The public transportation system in Hong Kong is one of the finest in the world, renowned for its reliability, punctuality, and safety. It provides comprehensive coverage, connecting even the most distant neighborhoods with the city center, which minimizes the need for private car use and reduces traffic congestion. The cleanliness and illumination of Hong Kong streets are another testament to the city's commitment to public safety. Well-lit streets prevent dark corners where crime could potentially hide, and the sense of order and cleanliness contributes to a feeling of security for those walking even late at night. Last but not the least, debt number 10. Zurich, Switzerland. Zurich continues to invest heavily in public services, including a highly efficient public transportation system that is considered one of the safest and most punctual in the world. Zurich's social strategies extend to the urban environment, with public spaces designed to be inclusive and engaging. Parks, squares, and public amenities are well-maintained, promoting a high quality of life and community interaction. This design philosophy not only enriches the city aesthetically, but also enhances social cohesion, as these spaces become hubs for community life. The high level of civic engagement and the resultant social oversight contribute to Zurich's low crime rates, as residents take pride in and look after their city. And that's a wrap on our journey through some of the safest cities around the globe in 2024. We've seen how efficient urban design, inclusive social policies, and proactive law enforcement contribute to the remarkable safety of these urban havens. If you enjoyed this enlightening expedition, don't forget to like this video and hit that subscribe button. Also tap the notification bell so you won't miss out on our upcoming virtual tours and insightful discussions. Is there a city that you feel deserves a spot on this list? Go ahead and drop a comment below. We love hearing your thoughts and who knows, your suggested city might be featured in our next video. You may also want to watch 10 Cutest Creatures Unveiled and Amazing Facts About the Month of November. Until next time, thank you for watching.